from our North Idaho newsroom, a Coeur d'Alene man sleeping in a dumpster was jolted into a garbage truck early this morning. It happened at Coeur d'Alene City Hall. 47-year-old Alan Wilson is now listed in serious condition at Kootenai Medical Center. KXLY4's Annie Bishop live in Coeur d'Alene tonight. Annie, what happened? Well, about 4 o'clock this morning, Wilson was apparently sleeping right inside this recycling container when a driver from Waste Management backed up his rig, lifted this container about 10 feet in the air, dumping everything, including Wilson, inside of his truck. The driver, not knowing he had a passenger on board, then drove to the nearby dumpster in the Coeur d'Alene parking, library parking lot. The containers are locked, requiring the driver to get out and open the gates. When the driver stepped out of his cab, he discovered Wilson climbing out of the truck. We're told the driver tried to keep Wilson inside the truck until help could arrive. Wilson then jumped 10 feet or so to the ground, causing serious injuries. It's not clear why Wilson was inside the dumpster. He is listed with a Coeur d'Alene address. You know, I would say that it's a rare event. I wouldn't say that it's uh, the first, but um, it is something to be aware of. Dumpsters are a common place for uh, people to sleep when they don't have anywhere else to go. And because this is such an isolated incident, the city says it's highly unlikely it will change any policies regarding dumpsters. It's already clearly posted here on any dumpster. You're not to play or even occupy this container for any purpose. Reporting live in Coeur d'Alene, Annie Bishop, KXLY4 HD News.